right, let's look at what's these shoes. All right, which one you want to see first? The red ones or the fishy ones? The fishy ones. Fishy ones. So look at my shoes, guys. Look at my shoes, guys. From my birthday. To my birthday. You want to try them on? Uh-huh. Okay, let's try them on. Hold on, let me show the peoples. All righty, fishy shoes. Coming right up. Coming right up. <laughs> All right, this is pair number two. Red shoes to match Royce's outfit. Isn't it cute? Uh-huh. Cute? I meant to put it on. Okay, let's try those on. So let's take your orange shoes off, and we're going to put these on, okay? Hey, y'all. All right, so it is excuse the shining. It's like I don't know how to do the light where my son. I want you to be quiet. I don't know how to do the light. Let me see. Yeah, I don't know, y'all. I don't know how to do the light where it's, like, still bright enough, but, like, the light's not bouncing off my face. Um, take my hair down. All right, so I am going to, I got my clothes from Shein in. I'm going to go ahead and open it up. Um, most of the stuff is for me. I already got Royce's clothes, and as you guys saw in an earlier clip, I got him his shoes. He just needs one more outfits okay <laughs> he just needs one more outfit and then we're done all right so i'm gonna put like pictures of what i ordered up on the screen baby it's your jacket okay we got everything we got everything should I do try on? Because I'm going to do try on for my Instagram. But yeah. I might include some clips in here. Uh, for a try on. It's my jacket. You want to see your jacket? Okay, come stand up. We could do Royce's try on. Come. Hands up. Uh oh. Okay, we can't. Pee. Alright, so I really got Royce some like cargo pants. Ooh, these too big. These are too big. What size I got? Uh two to three year old. Dang it. Ooh, baby, these too big. These are like way too big for him. I could already tell. Come on, baby. Let's try it on. Let's see if it's too big for you. I really got it to match my outfit. Come on, hurry up. Alright, let me go put a bra on and then I will um Start trying clothes on so we can see how it looks. All right, you guys, this is the. Let me fix the camera some. Okay, so this is the first top that I got. I can already tell that I'm gonna be having to fix this part a lot, and it's like I don't want to show my butt look at all. But it has like this little thing in the back, and then in the front. Fun fact, so I used to want to be a designer when I was growing up and I uh, drew like a top that was similar to this and this just reminded me of that top because when I drew this top like this, I was like, oh my gosh, if I could if I could sell these, it would be a hit for sure because it's a unique design. And so, yeah, <laughs> I just, it just reminded me of that. I plan to wear these with some shorts. I'm actually going to try them on right now or just a pair of shorts to see how it'll look with shorts. So let me go grab some and come right back. All right, these are, let me turn this light up. These are some black shorts. I honestly might consider like tucking Hi, the back part Hi. in. Hi, baby. And Hi. leaving the front Hi. part Hi. out. Hi. But this is how it looks. So I'm going to wear this on the third day, like his actual birthday. So we're just going to go to close it. Close it. So we're going to go to Urban Air again on the on his actual birthday, which is a Monday. But we're celebrating on Saturday. 
at the aquarium and then sunday at the park so it's gonna be like a little three-day affair so aquarium on saturday park on no, 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 no. sunday and then on monday i'm gonna go to the uh, to over an ear and i just wanted something just like cute and you know whatever cute stylish because i'm gonna probably take pictures um jeans i might actually wear like a longer jeans you okay longer jeans and not do shorts but i'm still deciding and i might not wear a bra with this because this bra thing is just annoying me but this is potentially outfit number one Alrighty, so like I said, we are going to the aquarium and it's very much like aqua theme, not mermaid theme, but like fishy theme. Um, because you know, he was asking for fish the whole time, like for six months for his birthday. So we decided to do, or I decided to do um the aquarium like baby shark type fish theme. So I bought like a blue dress very much like water vibes this right here i'll be wearing to the park this was like some little sandals some flats or whatever and just pretty much basic simple i don't remember how much this dress cost but i um will link it in the back like i ordered a medium it's very tight on me but it's like whatever uh you know it's cute i like it Okay, guys, so here is top number three. I um think these need to be, like, a little bit more tightened like that. Let me see if I can do that right now. I won't. But, yeah, it just needs to be, like, a little bit. Hold on, y'all. I'm being lazy. All right, so it's a little tighter now. And I like this one. This is so cute. I was this is what I was the most excited about because I love corset um tops and I've been wanting to get more into the corset vibes. I feel like for the thicker girls corset and then like and then like a high waist um pants or bottom like really like, you know, cinches you in and makes you look like very it's like very flattering on thicker females as myself um and then i'm gonna pair this with a cargo pants i am nervous about it because i don't know if it's gonna fit me i ordered a size x large and my first time my pants from shein so let's see how it fits this is a pants and it's giving very much plastic holding it up to me it looks like it might it should fit it's huge like it's like parachute pants this is my first ever cargo pants um like cargo style pants it's so thin like i'm not surprised because it's shein and it was just 16 dollars. but yeah it's it's thin y'all it's thin all right let me go look in the mirror first no it definitely needed to be tighter uh, I don't know how I feel about it. Like, it needs to be like a little bit tighter. What are you doing, baby? Okay. All right, so that is it, you guys, for this sec for for this for this section of the getting ready for Royce's birthday. Uh, vlog or video i do have um next steps are to get his f-i-s f-i-s-h um at petco or pet smart his dad and i are gonna have to figure out like, a time that we can do it and how we're gonna hide the fish from him and uh then i have to get him a toy or a power wheel jeep that he can you know and then how to figure out how to hide that from him and then um i'm getting my nails done i'm gonna get my nails done on thursday might do my toes might or might not do my toes i'll have to figure that out and uh oh i gotta order his birthday cake it's wednesday i forgot my son's birthday. i forgot my son's birthday cake y'all like oh we did like a baby shark birthday cake from public so hopefully one of the four publics is around my area can have a cake ready by Saturday. Well, not Saturday, Sunday.
Sunday. Yeah, by Sunday. I don't think it should be a problem, but I have to get on that like two nights and put that order in. I'm a thumb. But yeah, so I will continue to bring you guys along on the little getting ready for Royce's birthday. I'm so excited because he's at that age where like he can get excited for his birthday and where he can like appreciate his toys and appreciate like a celebrating his birthday. So I'm like really, really excited. I cannot wait until he gets like older and older and older and we can do like more things and like celebrate him more to where he can like really enjoy it because his first birthday he slept throughout the whole time at Urban Air and then at the trampoline park and then uh the second time you know he had fun we went to the lake and we went to the park the second day and he he did have fun and his sister did have fun as well um but this time I know he's actually gonna like really remember it and just really enjoy it and I'm just like so excited for him hey y'all so it is um 6 42 I've gotten off of work for like pretty much 40 minutes now and I was trying to decide like whether I should get my nails in or not because like I had to stop and get cash and blah 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 so I was like should I just wait till tomorrow and I was gonna reschedule for tomorrow at 6 30 but she has to go to Athens Georgia and so it wouldn't have worked out so we're gonna uh do our nail appointment tomorrow at 7 a.m so yeah 7 a.m tomorrow um 7 30 a.m tomorrow i'm gonna get in my bed tonight early because i need to wake up on time because i'm not missing this like i, I can't even show y'all how bad this is and i want to get oh What if I don't have to think of a fit on tomorrow? But I have work to do. I have, I have work to do. I can't. It's too late. I have work to do. Okay. Anyways, um, speaking of the what I have to do, so the aid, so the offer that I put in yesterday, it looks like ours might get accepted. However, he did want it. He didn't want to let me know that the area that the condo is in was just zoned and placed in a uh, flood zone area, right? or it's now technically flood, a flood zone area. And uh, he wanted to be sure that his mortgage company wouldn't require flood insurance. And if he, it does have flood insurance, then that's a whole different cost. So I'm going to, when I get home, I'm gonna email them, his loan officer, and see if he may need flood insurance, if she could fact check or whatever. And um, I'm gonna try to make it seem as chill, like, you know, like even though it is, very low flood risk um especially with his condo because he is on top you know and the agent said that he sold about the agent said that he sold about five of those condos and none of the sellers ever had any issues with flooding and it's been around it's, it was built in like 1970 so yeah <laughs> i just want to make sure that everybody's calm and just everybody's chill out you know, let's take let's get this thing on the contract. So I'm gonna email her, then I'm gonna tell the clients that I, I'm trying to I'm debating whether I should text him or not. You know, I will. I'll text him and I'll talk to him about it. Uh, so maybe he can. Well, no, I can't do this weekend because I'm busy. I'm busy. So it's Royce's birthday weekend. Anyways. Besides that part, I also have to um, send some emails out um, to someone that's going to be doing some Facebook ads for me. I decided to hire someone, and I've been praying about it, and I really do think that God is, has placed the right... God is honestly placing the right people in my team. Like, he asked me to, to do a business plan. He asked me to figure out how I want my team to be and build certain, you know, departments and whatnot. And the fact that he, because I'm being obedient, he's, you know, providing the people. Is that man okay? He's in the middle of the road. That's crazy. Uh, but yeah, so, you know, he's really just providing the people. So I'm just like all excited. And I'm just, I, and God's been reminding me like, it may not be easy, but just keep at it, keep at it, keep at it. So, you know. Um, so that's it for this evening. I'm gonna post a TikTok. Oh Lord, sorry y'all. The nail tech just messaged me and I wanted to make sure that she wasn't trying to say I can't come in the morning because I just, my nails are in rough shape and 
I did not order a wig. I sacrificed my wig. I will. I refuse to sacrifice my nails. That is just not happening. Okay. I've been going weeks without my nails, so I need to get it done. Anyways, I'm at Walmart right now. I'm going to run in to get Royce some diapers, and then I'm going to look to see if they have um, uh, any power wheels, because I wanted to get him a little mini Jeep, like maybe like a white Wrangler type looking car for his birthday. So I'm going to run in there to see if they have any of that, and that's that. Good morning, you guys. It is Friday and it is 7.21 in the morning. I am up bright and early because I have a nail appointment. I was supposed to get it done yesterday evening at 6.30, but it just didn't work out. And we were gonna, I asked if I could reschedule for today, same time, 6.30, but she has um, to go somewhere. So yeah, she has to travel. <clears throat> out of the city so 7 30 is her new appointment time i was gonna do like a medium uh square nude but i'll just do a short square white or just maybe like a short square like a nudish brown like a light nude color like yeah so we'll see how it goes i would I, i'm not gonna do one, I'm gonna do short because I'm, I don't wanna be late for work. And two, because I didn't get to do my baby's hair and I'm praying that I could get to do his hair tonight and I have to have my nails short to do them. I, Cause he has soft texture here and I can't, you know what I'm saying? It's already hard enough as it is and I really need to get a good grip. And so later on for today in this um, get ready for his birthday weekend vlog, on my lunch break, I'm gonna run to Old Navy and I have to get him some, a top and a pants. I have to get him a top and a pants. And then, do you need pants? He needs a top, he needs a new shirt for tomorrow actually, because the shirt that I, that I picked out for him, it wasn't looking the way I wanted it to look. <laughs> so I'm just gonna let him wear that at the park and then his other shirt at Urban Air. I also have to go to Walmart afterwards to get him like a little four-wheeler. I think I know the one that I want to pick out, but I'm going to try another Walmart. I'm going to go to, I might go to the one in Groveton because I want to get my nails done, my toes done. And the, where I go to get my toes done is in Groveton. Or where I went the last time, or where I wanted to, where I want to go to get my toes done is in Groveton, so I might go to Groveton to the Walmart and Grove Town to look for his thing. You know, I'm just gonna check to see what their site says. If they have any four wheelers. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Either way he's gonna be happy. And then his dad who is just always working, um, he needs to figure out how he's gonna get his fish. Cause I'm getting everything else. So he needs to figure out how like when he's gonna get because I don't have any time. Like I'm I'm tight today. Like I'm packed today. So, yeah, he needs to figure out how he's going to get, because he has to get that fish. If he can meet me, he needs to meet me at 12 o'clock today at PetSmart to get that, that fish. Yeah. Anyway, that is pretty much what's on the agenda today. I will bring you guys along, and then that'll be the eight for, the, for today's video. Oh. All right, you guys, I'm back. Let me pay attention. So here see all right i'm gonna have to show you guys when i'm done driving um but she made great time she really only takes an hour to do a short set like honestly when i say like on time on time like i'm gonna get there at 8 52 so i'm gonna get to work when i said perfect time perfect time and i'm happy that i did short because the way that she does her short like it's not like super duper duper short like it's still like you know, you can't really tell. But it's still like a very good length. So this length right here, like if I need to do someone's hair this week, which is like my son's hair, I gotta do my son's hair. But if I, if I do have to do braids, I'll be able to still do my braids. All right, you guys, I just left. Um, okay, so I just left Old Navy and I need gas. And I, what does it say? $20 off in store. I have to spend $50, of course. 
whatever. Um, so I just bought him a little uh, t-shirt to go under his jacket that he has for tomorrow. And uh, I wanted to, get, wanted to get him colors that match my outfit. And I'm doing like a nudish brown. And then I got him some pants. These pants were $22, yo. I've never bought a pair of pants for myself for $22. Why? Man, they had a big old red $10 on there. I was like, can you see this is on sale? Because it, it, I thought both the jeans and the other shirt, I mean, I mean, that pants were on sale. Apparently not. $32 for those two not $32 $35 for those two little pieces of clothing like listen I'm I'm a sheen shopper I'm not gonna complain I'm not gonna complain as long as he looks cute that's all that matters I think what I'm like trying not to panic about is about how much money that I'm spending you know I'm just trying not to panic about because I know it's gonna add up quick you know, between the aquarium, between like what I bought yesterday for um the goodie, like for his for the when we go to the park, um picking up his birthday cake, it's just I'm just hearing cha ching cha ching cha ching in my head. <laughs> but I'm trying to tell myself at least I can pay for it, and uh, he's gonna have a good time. This is what I wanted. You know, so that's all that matters. Hey y'all, so it is the end of the day. It is like, I don't even know, maybe seven o'clock or so. Um, I just got home, maybe like, what, 15, maybe like 10 minutes ago. Um, after I left work, I came home. I got off work early, thank God. Came home, I, um, I'm so exhausted. Came home, got Royce ready. My mom got ready and went to the mall so I could get her uh, outfit to wear tomorrow. She just bought two dresses. So one for the one for tomorrow, one for the park. And then um, then I went to the hair store to get like a few things like a comb, press on for my feet, so I didn't get to my feet, and something else. And uh, I'm now at home about to do Voices hair. I didn't bother to get my my son's the car that I was supposed to get for voice today. I'm gonna try to do, get get it tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow morning I'll get it. Like yeah, I'll just I'll get it tomorrow morning. I factor that part in. Um, I spent too much money today, and I deposited my check today, but I only get like I don't get the full amount. Like I get like a small little bit, and then the full amount comes in tomorrow so i'm really trying to piss myself and not trying to exhaust myself like i, I like i spent four hundred dollars today i spent four hundred dollars today guys four hundred dollars today what did i even buy i don't even remember what i buy ask me i don't even remember what i bought but i know it was four hundred dollars though anywho i'm about to do voices here i'm going to try to do like a simple style and wish me luck i'm about to watch I'm about to watch how to is it I'm about to watch is it cake while I do his hair. And yeah, so let me do that and I will come back on camera once it's done and then give you guys a little mini haul of his outfit that I bought and the rest of the things that I bought today. Alright, so it is what like I don't know the light is bad. I'm just tired and just trying to get going. It is like almost ten o'clock. I have not even well, I did one single bread and what's his hair. He's tender headed in his sleep for some reason. Oh, by the way, nails. By the way, these are my nails. But yeah, he's tender headed in his sleep for some reason. I don't have the energy or the brain cells to do that right now. So I'm just going to wash my uh his clothes. Um this is what I got him for from a from this is what I got him. This is what I got him from Old Navy. And uh, just like a nude shirt, he's gonna wear that. Put the in the washer with the tag on and everything. He's gonna wear this. I'm weird, y'all. So I wash my clothes before I before we wear them, because you know I just figured that's the most sanitary thing to do. Uh, all right. He's gonna wear that with his jean jacket from Shein. 
his first jean jacket ever so cute and what is that oh and these are the pants that he's wearing so yeah this is what he's wearing Alrighty, like you saw i am wearing like brown type colors so i wanted him to like kind of just like to like kind of match you know and i hope this fits yeah this should fit him this will fit him yeah all right what else do i want to wash in here that's what i think that's it guys i'm going to wash my hair i'm not filming that part i'm gonna style my hair like the wig how i want it to be and that is it for this video i'm gonna go ahead and try to edit this video tonight and upload it for tomorrow for tomorrow and then yeah tomorrow i'm doing like the car getting his car and we're gonna go to the aquarium so i hope that we all have fun his dad cannot make it because he has to work both days I was telling him, like, make sure you tell your boss in advance, 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 advance. But somebody up and quit on them. So, he doesn't have any, he, like, no kind of coverage at all. So, he really can't do anything about it. So, it's going to be me, my mom, and all his kids going to the aquarium. And then for the park, it's going to be probably me and the kids again. Um, Their biological mom wants to take him to the splash park. She has something planned on sunday so hopefully they get to come to the park with us because we're doing we're doing that at 11 o'clock in the morning so but you know we'll see we'll see how it goes and yeah uh thank you guys for watching this video hopefully it wasn't too all over the place it's my first time you make a little um birthday get ready with me type or get ready vlog so try my best I will see you guys in my next video, which will be Royce's birthday vlog. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, I'll see you in my next one. Bye.